Hey you guys, this is Mr. Sal. This is number 30 on the practice test. It's got two parts, but it's not too bad, so let's go ahead and get to it. The first part, we need to write an equation that requires the addition property of equality to solve it and has negative 16 as its solution. So what this means is that we're going to have to add something uh, to both sides in order to get a solution of negative 16. In other words, our final answer on this first part is x equals negative 16. Well, if I expand this, so let's say that I subtract from both sides, maybe, I don't know, 4. That'll make it very nice, but I have to do it to both sides. Then I have x minus 4 equals a negative 20. Here is a problem that requires the addition property of equality to solve it and has a solution of negative 16. There it is. So notice all I'm doing is starting with the solution and then I'm manipulating it in order to make it look like something else that would require whichever property it's asking us to do. And some of you guys noticed that I used the inverse property, uh, the inverse operation rather, of addition which is subtraction which will require us to use addition. Now on the second part we have a solution of x equals negative 6. We need to use division on this so I'm going to multiply both sides by whatever number I want maybe something easy like not even 5 maybe something like 10. Okay, So now I have a new equation 10x equals negative 60 and in order to solve this equation right here I would have to use division on both sides and so this would be an equation that works on this problem. 